Everton went into their match with Derby at the bottom of the championship, their lowest league position since 1993. Not a good time to take on a Ram side who'd won 5-1 at Millwall just four days previously. Dougie Friedman's side though did take the lead. Chris Eagles and Lee Chung Yong combined to set up Alex Baptiste, who showed an excellent touch to make space, and squeezy shot pass keeper Lee Grant. The Rams travelled to the Reebok with a 100% record on the road and they turned things around to lead inside 20 minutes. The best move of the night saw the home defence carved open for the equaliser. Jamie Ward's clever back heel played in the weekend's hat-trick hero Craig Bryson and his cross was turned in by Johnny Russell for his third goal so far. And 11 minutes later Will Hughes' speculative shot hit teammate Bryson who again set up a simple chance for Russell to score his second of the match. An entertaining first half continued with more chances. Chris Eagles tried his luck from distance, but Grant made a good save, although he couldn't hold on to the ball. Eagles had a second opportunity, but again Grant was at his best to make another stop. With the first half drawing to a close, Bolton did get themselves back on level terms. Tim Ream played the ball forward to Eagles, and this time his shot bounced awkwardly in front of Grant and found the bottom corner. Bolton remained as one of two sides without a league win after a goalless second half. Derby went close to retaking the lead after another nice build-up. Ward's cross shot from the angle was pushed out by Adam Bogdan straight to Adam Smith, whose goal-bound effort was blocked and eventually cleared by Matt Mills. The introduction of Jermaine Beckford and David and Gog couldn't help Bolton search for three points, although when Gog did get on the end of Jay Spearing's cross, but glanced his header just wide. Just three points out of a possible 21 now for Bolton, while the Rams have lost twice so far and sit eighth in the table.